Alright guys, this is Stephen Gowe, Technical Analyst of Allies Flu. So in this video, I'll discuss about Zinc. So as we discussed yesterday, and we are looking for a buy in the Zinc, uh, but we didn't get any buy opportunity. So let me show you. So in a daily chart, we have Zinc is running in a downtrend according to moving average crossover. And uh, this is, we have seen this is the retracement. But if you want to see in a four hour chart, price is running in an uptrend all right so if you want to see uh, daily uh, according to the price action method price are creating higher high and higher low here have you seen higher high higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low but now we have seen some retracement from uh, this previous higher point and we have seen there was a supporting line so exactly i'm gonna draw here by connecting 200 exponential moving average around 192 that was a supporting line and we drawn a horizontal supporting line around 192 all right and we are looking for a buy above this level all right so let me show you um, in a four hour chart so four hour chart according to the previous market behavior you can see we have seen price up bouncing from moving average 20 have you seen bounce retrace bounce and a retrace all right and let me show you uh, according to fibonacci so let me draw fibonacci so exactly we have seen there is 50 percent of retracement here all right have you seen so we have seen this is a strong support that means if you want to see according to the previous market behavior they are respecting as a resistance have you seen here they are respecting as a resistance in this line or you can uh, place here also doesn't matter whatever so they are respecting as a resistance now respecting as a support and according to 20 moving average we have seen price are bouncing from this area right from 20 moving average that means from this area it is a high probability to uh, reverse back again right this is a correction and is a high probability to go up right uh, that is why we drawn here as a resist a supporting line so this area called confluence zone right so most of the people are waiting to take buy in this area remember if price break this level we are looking for next target somewhere here so let me draw some another supporting line okay so i want to connect more touches point here so have you seen i just connected more touches point here right support and resistance both side they are respecting remember if price break this level we are targeting toward this area and but now we are looking for a buy opportunity here so i'll exactly i'll show you in a 15 minute chart when to enter in this market all right so let me show you in a small time frame like uh, 15 minute so 15 minute we have seen uh here like that right so let me just a little more i want to connect more touches point here now you can see in a 15 minute uh, time frame we have seen here one reverse back again retrace reverse back retrace reverse back so we have seen three uh, rejection in this area that means it is forming a strong support around 192.73 remember once price break this level we are confirming uh, toward the uh, downside right so we are looking for sell below 192.73 so we are looking for sell below not now now we are looking for a buy here so can i enter here buy directly no that is a wrong entry so that is why we are looking for a more confirmation how we will get the more confirmation that is why I want to draw a resistance line that is called diagonal resistance line right so I just trying to connect more touches point here so have you seen we have seen here touches reverse back here again reverse back hit reverse hit reverse back hit reverse so we have seen multiple rejection from this diagonal uh, trend line 
so we are looking for a buy after breaking this level so similarly we have seen uh, in a small time frame here we have seen another multiple rejection here hit rejection right hit rejection and they are trying to so in that case we are looking for buy above this area so that is called uh, high confluence right zone so once they break this level around 194 you can assume like 194 194 once they break 194 we will start buying above this area and remember place your sl uh, just calculate this lower point all right so in that case we are looking for percentage r should be break zero level right so once the break so we can enter here for the buy and your target will be somewhere here previous higher point right and a trading trading ratio will be one is two two right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please uh, like and subscribe Thanks for watching.